Good morning, Sean. The Red Cross is helping Nashua residents who are still without a permanent place to sleep after a five-alarm fire tore through two apartment buildings Monday. Representatives from the America Red Cross told News 9 that they have set up a temporary shelter at St. Louis de Gonzaga Parish. The Red Cross has been providing victims of the fire on West Hollis Street with three meals a day and a place to sleep. Hector Marble and his girlfriend Anna were relaxing with their three-week-old baby in their ap Nashua apartment Monday when they heard a knock at the door. A massive fire was tearing through their building and they had to get out. The fire destroyed their apartment on West Hollis Street. Marble and his family have been staying at the temporary shelter, but it closes Thursday at 9 a.m. At least five people still have no place to go. The fire impacted 30 people, including Kristen LaRoche. LaRoche said she's lucky to be staying with her daughter, but she lost nearly everything in the fire. Marble and his family lost nearly everything in the fire, including diapers, bottles, and blankets for their baby girl. You can help their family by donating at their GoFundMe page. Reporting live here outside St. Louis de Gonza Parish, I'm Riley King for WMUR News 9. Sean, back over to you.